Monkeypox cases are rising fast in Georgia as COVID transmission levels are still high. Well, now we have a new public health emergency and the outbreak in the state has us taking a closer look. I stopped by Memorial Health to find out how the virus is spread and how to protect yourself. The first case of monkeypox in Georgia was confirmed during the first week of June. The majority of people get it through close intimate contact. With over 950 cases, Dr. Tim Connolly with Memorial Health says those who tested in Chatham County all tested negative. But looking at the fact that there's over 10,000 cases in the United States, it's just a matter of time before we do have a case or two here, if not a few more. While gay and bisexual men are most at risk, Dr. Connolly says both women and children have also been infected with monkeypox. The amount of contact, the amount of lesions somebody has, all of those factor into your likelihood of getting the infection. So sexual contact isn't the only mode of transmission. Like if somebody sneezed immediately right in your face, you know, prolonged kissing, definitely possible, you know, snuggling and rubbing up against a lesion for a period of time, all those things, it's probable. However, it's highly unlikely you'll get it while performing normal day-to-day -day activities. It's not something that out and about in downtown Savannah you're going to have to worry about getting just because you were out with your friends. According to the Georgia Department of Public Health, you should avoid close skin-to-skin -skin contact with people with the virus. You shouldn't share eating utensils or cups or touch the bedding, towels, or clothing of a person with monkeypox. Once you have lesions, that's when it becomes contagious and you're contagious until the lesions completely crust over and heal, which can be about three weeks time. While that time can be painful, fortunately, there have been no deaths in the U.S. If somebody's experiencing severe disease, come seek medical attention because the, vi the medication we have is highly effective. It's stopping the virus in its tracks. Now, if you do come in close contact with someone who has monkeypox, it's important to isolate. The average incubation period is eight to nine days. Now, the monkeypox vaccine is available to those most at risk at the Chatham and Glenn County Health Departments. Right now in South Carolina, there are 73 cases of monkeypox. Those eligible for the vaccine there can call the DHEC care line. We've put that number on our website at WJCL.com.